For the first time, Tesla has built a real car in just 30 seconds. Not a concept, but a functioning production line now operating in Texas. Elon Musk calls it the unboxed production line, a system that replaces the century-old assembly model with parallel robotic modules working in perfect sync. No welding, no human assembly, only precision automation redefining car manufacturing itself. Could this be the true end of assembly line? Let's dive right in. For more than a century, car manufacturing has looked the same. A single line, hundreds of workers, thousands of parts, each car inching forward until it finally rolls out as a finished product. That's how Henry Ford built the Model T, and how almost every automaker still builds cars today. It's efficient by old world standards, but in the age of robotics and AI, it has become painfully slow. Elon Musk saw that clearly. To him, the traditional assembly line wasn't innovation. It was a bottleneck. A system that made it impossible to build millions of affordable EVS fast enough to change the world. So Tesla didn't tweak the system. They erased it. Inside Giga Texas, Tesla engineers have quietly been assembling something unprecedented the world's first unboxed production line, a system designed not to improve car manufacturing, but to reinvent it from the ground up. Instead of one endless conveyor belt, Tesla splits the process into parallel modules. Each module focuses on a specific section, front chassis, floor structure, rear cabin, and body panels. Every module works independently, but simultaneously, and when they're done, the car doesn't roll out in stages. All sections merge at once, locking together in a single, synchronized moment. That's how Tesla can build an entire car in 30 seconds. Not a prototype, not a simulation, an actual functioning vehicle. This approach doesn't just cut time. It redefines the entire idea of a factory. Of course, assembling pre-painted panels this way requires extreme accuracy. A single misalignment could destroy the car's surface. That's why Tesla designed robotic arms equipped with vacuum suction cups. Machines that lift, position, and attach panels without ever touching the paint. Then comes the true innovation. Tesla no longer relies on bolts or welding. Instead, it uses industrial-grade structural adhesive, a bonding compound stronger, lighter, and more flexible than metal joints. The adhesive layer, known internally as the engineered gap, acts like a shock absorber for the entire car. It handles vibration, heat, and expansion while maintaining perfect structural integrity. The result? A quieter, smoother, and more durable car, built faster, cheaper, and with fewer materials. Tesla estimates that this system cuts 65% of mechanical fasteners while spending just $25 worth of adhesive per car. For comparison, traditional automakers spend hundreds on bolts, welding, and alignment correction. That single line item could save Tesla billions every year. What makes the unboxed process possible isn't just clever design, it's data. Tesla's robots all operate on a shared global datum, a digital reference map of the car's geometry. In a normal factory, each robot aligns parts based on its local area. Small errors add up, creating uneven panel gaps. But Tesla's system allows every robot to see the car as a unified whole, adjusting its movement based on millimeter-level precision. That's how Tesla finally solved one of its biggest early criticisms, uneven panel gaps. Now, every surface fits seamlessly, with robotic precision no human could replicate. This is where engineering meets orchestration, a factory that behaves more like a living, synchronized machine than a human-led production line. Traditional factories waste enormous time waiting, 
waiting for paint to dry, glue to cure, or machines to reset. Elon Musk saw that as unacceptable. Tesla's answer? Hot melt adhesives and locator pins. The hot melt compound holds panels instantly, while locator pins keep parts locked in place until the permanent adhesive hardens. That means no pauses. While one vehicle's glue is curing, another is already being assembled. Production becomes a continuous flow, almost like an automated heartbeat. Steady, fast, and relentless. In Musk's words, it's so fast, it would be dangerous for humans to stand too close. This isn't an exaggeration. The new line moves at consumer electronics speed, more similar to building smartphones than cars. The first unboxed production line is already coming to life at Giga Texas, Tesla's largest and most advanced factory. Drone footage confirms new robotic modules, adhesive systems, and paint cells already installed. When fully optimized, Tesla aims to produce one complete car every five seconds. That's four to five times faster than the current Model 3 or Model Y lines. This pace doesn't just increase output. It transforms Tesla's cost structure. With the same workforce and footprint, Tesla could double or even triple production, slashing per-car costs and giving birth to the long-awaited $25,000 EV era. The debut product of this revolutionary system is not a luxury sedan or SUV. It's the CyberCab, Tesla's fully autonomous robo-taxi. Each CyberCab will cost roughly $30,000 to produce, far cheaper than any current EV of its kind. And once mass production stabilizes, the same unboxed system will be used for Tesla's Model 2, under the code name Project Redwood. That compact car, designed as Tesla's first truly mass-market vehicle, will feature a 54-kilowatt-hour battery, 250 miles of range, and Tesla's AI5 self-driving computer the same platform being tested in next-gen Model Ys. If it launches on schedule in 2026, Tesla could deliver over 4 million units per year at a price accessible to middle-class families worldwide. Tesla's breakthrough doesn't exist in a vacuum. Competitors in China, BYD, Xpeng, NIO, are already racing to reverse-engineer the concept. Because once one company proves it can build cars five times faster, the rest of the world has two choices, adapt or die. Analysts are already calling this the Model T moment of the 21st century, a transformation that could shift manufacturing dominance away from legacy automakers to those who can think modularly and scale infinitely. If Tesla's system becomes the new norm, it won't just change EVS. It will rewrite how every major product on Earth is built. There's one question everyone is afraid to ask. If robots can build a car in seconds, where does that leave human workers? Elon Musk's vision is clear. Humans will still design, program, and oversee, but robots will do the building. Not because it's cheaper, but because precision manufacturing is now beyond human ability. It's controversial, it's disruptive, but it's also inevitable. The unboxed factory represents a philosophical shift. The machine is no longer the tool, it's the craftsman. Tesla isn't just making cars faster, it's redefining what factory means. No more sparks, smoke, or chaos, just silent efficiency. Every second saved here translates into affordability for millions of consumers waiting for a Tesla they can finally afford. This is why 2026 might mark the true beginning of the next industrial revolution. A world where electric vehicles are built in seconds, not hours. And at the center of it all stands Elon Musk. Not as just a CEO, but as the architect of a new kind of manufacturing civilization. One where speed, precision, and intelligence merge into something entirely new. If Tesla can build a car in 30 seconds today, 
How long until it takes just five? And when that day comes, will any other automaker be able to keep up? Tell us what you think. Could this really be the end of assembly lines as we know them? Tesla's 30-second factory isn't just a faster way to build cars. It's proof that the next industrial revolution has already begun. By reimagining manufacturing from the ground up, Elon Musk may have just created the blueprint for how we'll one day build rockets, habitats, and technologies beyond Earth itself. This breakthrough shows that progress isn't only about invention, it's about reinventing the process of creation itself. What do you think? Will this transformation spread across every industry or stay a Tesla exclusive? Share your thoughts below. If you found this breakdown valuable, hit like, drop a comment, and subscribe to Tech Revolution. Then turn on notifications so you never miss our next deep dive into the future of technology. Because this isn't the end of the story, it's where the revolution truly begins.